How's it going, guys? So Brian Gutekunst was asked a bunch of questions at his annual interview at the NFL Combine this past Tuesday, with a lot of them being about our current quarterback limbo and what's going on with Aaron Rodgers. And it sounded like Gutekunst, he didn't really give much, but how he answered some questions were a bit eye-raising. And this isn't the first time in where when Brian Gutekunst was asked about Aaron Rodgers, he kind of gave a non-committal type of answer very similar to how Aaron Rodgers is kind of non-committal right now to playing this year, but he's been giving very non-committal answers and like, like, hey, do you want Aaron Rodgers back next year? And instead of giving definite answers like, yes, we would like him back, like hopefully he comes back or something of the sort, he gives very middle of the road answers. So when directly asked about Aaron Rodgers coming back, he said that there's no update and that the two sides haven't really conversated except besides a couple of text messages. And along the lines of Aaron Rodgers come back, he said those discussions have to happen and making sure that it's the right fit. But obviously we know the kind of player that Aaron is. Once we've had those conversations, we'll be able to move forward. So that right there is what I kind of meant by like middle of the road and it's not very committal to Aaron Rodgers because the right fit, what in Brian Gutekunst's right mind or in his mind is the right fit. What is he looking for? It's not, hey, if you want to come back, you're definitely going to be our quarterback, which makes sense because Jordan loves in the right behind him. And he had a down year and also what is going to be expected out of Aaron Rodgers and can they come to whatever this agreement that Brian Gutekunst has. He also added up that if Rodgers comes back that there's going to have to be a restructure of his contract of some sort. I don't know what type of restructure that could be or how they could change that weird contract of his and how much money we could potentially save if he stays with us and all of that. But it sounds like if he comes back, there has to be a restructure with his contract, which would alleviate more money and probably go in for one more year and actually go all in and alleviate even more cap space than we've already done with the restructures of other players. Then moving on to the part where he was asked about Jordan Love, he stated that he thinks he's ready to play and he thinks he's ready to be an NFL starting quarterback. He's worked really hard. He's shown a lot of progress, progression. I know he's really eager to have that, and I think that's the next step in his progression is to play. It sounds throughout this offseason so far that he wants Jordan Love to actually be his quarterback and is willing to move on with Jordan Love, especially from what he's seen behind the scenes and in the short term against Philly when he stepped in for Aaron Rodgers. And so in listening to him talk about Aaron Rodgers when asked questions about him and Jordan Love and when asked questions about him, he gives a more positive and like committal vibe when talking about Jordan Love. Like he wants Jordan Love to actually be the quarterback, but he's giving the diplomatic answer around Aaron Rodgers and not trying to stoke the fire too much and wait till he decides what he's going to do with his future. And he also stated that he would like to have an answer before March 15th, which is the start of free agency in the NFL, which is very fair. Aaron Rodgers has said he's not going to drag this on, which honestly, it's felt like he's dragged this on. But listening to him talk in the interview with that podcast, he said he didn't want to be like Brett Favre. And it kind of made sense because, yes, to us, it feels like he's dragging it on and he's taking forever. But in the sense of Brett Favre, who took till like May to even decide or when training camp's happening, retiring and deciding to come back. Maybe he's looking at it like that, like drag it on as long as Brett Favre did. But to us, we don't see that. We're just seeing it's been three months. I'd like an answer. You went on your weird darkness retreat. What's your answer? But until then, it looks like we're going to have a decision from Aaron Rodgers and this snowball will start rolling a lot faster. And if he's going to come back into the NFL, at l the least where he plays, who he plays for is a different conversation, but is he going to play next year will be the start of all this. Gutekunst has stated that whether Aaron Rodgers or Jordan Love is going to be QB next year, our roster is not going to be too much different. Obviously, Aaron Rodgers will be a big part of the roster if he decides to come back and plays for Green Bay, but not too much. And the moves Gutekunst is making is going to be for whoever is that quarterback and not for one specific quarterback. But let me know what you think down in the comments. If you like the video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel, and as always, Go Pack Go!